Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stampin' Jill creative team. And today I'm excited to share with you a project idea. When we sent out catalogs to some of our customers for the new annual catalog, we wanted to give them a little gift that they could use with the catalog. Um, this is the type of gift you could give to anyone really, but my thoughts come to like a coworker or somebody close to you in like an office type setting because it's used with post-it notes. We got some basic post-it notes just like this. This is a three by three um, pad of post-it notes. And then we actually cut them down with an industrial sized guillotine cutter and made them little one by three little tabs like this so that when they go through their catalog and find all the fun things that they wanna buy in there, they can just tag it with a cute little post-it. So what we did was we took this size and we made a little pro a little project form. So let me just show you kind of what I did. We took this paper, this is the Forever Greenery DSP from the Forever Fern Suite in the catalog and we thought it was so pretty. So what I did was I took my little post-it and using the Stampin' Sill Plus, this is the new adhesive that's in the catalog. This is the adhesive that's extra strong and I just adhered right on the back of the post-its and then I um, adhered it right to so that there's a little edge around each side just like that and then I took the rest of the DSP and I just folded it up so it made it kind of like a little book looking thing okay and then I took more of the Stampin' Sill and put it on the bottom. Isn't that amazing? It's so nice on there. And it's really sticky, so once it's down, it's down. But then I took another piece um, just to give it a little more um, strength and weight on the bottom, and I just adhered that to the bottom of my little book here. Just like that. Okay, and then this little flap likes to kind of pop up, so I would just take um, a glue dot and just on that top piece of post-it, I would just stick it down so that it stays closed. Okay, now let me bring in the completed project that we did. Here it is. This is using that Forever Fern suite of products. So cute and so fun to a friend that makes me smile. So this was really fun, a fun project to send to all of our friends that we gave our catalogs to. So I will give you the um, dimensions that I cut the papers to on this. The DSP I cut to one and a quarter by six and five eighths. And then the back piece was three and a half by one and a half. So not all post-it notes are created equ equally. That measurement may not fit every post-it that you use, but um, for this project, that's what I did. In general, I'll just tell you the back piece I cut to be a half inch around the post-it, and then I cut the DSP accordingly to fit in between that size. So you can kind of go from there once you measure your, your post-it notes. Okay, one other that I wanted to show you I wanted to do another project using a full package of post-its because that might be a fun gift to give somebody. Maybe you have a coworker that's having a birthday or somebody that could use post-its all the time. I don't know, I use them all the time, but maybe that's just me. I took some of this DSP. This is the Artistry Blooms DSP from the catalog. And I'm just gonna do the exact same thing. I'm gonna adhere the post-it down onto the DSP, just like that. And then again, I'm gonna just wrap it around like a book and kind of fold the edges so that it stays. And then put some more Stampin' Still, Stampin' Still Plus on the back and then adhere it to my back piece, just like that. And again, I will put another glue dot down. Come on. Just to hold it down there. 
just like that. So fun. And I'll bring in the finished one. And I used the hand-drawn bloom stamp set here on this one. I thought it was so pretty and I just popped some of it up and colored them with blends and it turned out so fun. So just a fun little project for you to try. Give it a try and let us know what you think. Um, we have loved playing with all the fun new products in the new annual catalog. If it's something you're interested in and you don't have a demonstrator, make sure to let us know and we'd be happy to send you a copy. Um, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.